Welcome to techyv.com, your solution providers. Uh, this is Abhishek and today we're gonna work on the adjustment layer using a layer mask. So an adjustment layer is, uh, diff there are different kind of adjustment layers like for uh, using curves or using exposure, using black and white, using hue and saturation adjustment layer. So what we're gonna work on today is use a layer mask to actually hide the effects over a particular portion of an image and then apply the effects that we want to apply to the rest of the image and we're gonna use layer masks to do that and it's okay so let's jump right in I think mm. okay yeah this one seems right so this is our image let me just unblock the background uh, or maybe not okay so as you can see if I use a pen tool so I'm gonna have to press ctrl Z to remove the effects but if I take a layer over it then I can hide all these effects on her hands and leave it uh, the ones on her face you can see I can hide the layer and that isn't gonna affect my original image let me just delete it by grabbing it here so what we're gonna do is we're gonna tone down the exposure of her hands by using expose an adjustment there for exposure so yeah that seems right okay but what we're gonna do is we're gonna take an eraser tool and create uh, depth and uh, exposure in just your hands and not the rest of her face and we're gonna do it by I think we should increase the exposure um, maybe so this was our original exposure and we're gonna take it down a little bit and that seems quite it okay okay so now we're gonna inverse the layer mask by pressing ctrl i and paint over with the brush in white color all over the portions that we were gonna hide right hand here let me just create holes in this mask so as you can see in the layer panel it's all black means we have applied a hidden mask over our layer mask and then we're trying to hide all this portion on this left hand so what we're gonna do is we're gonna only apply our exposure to just this hands to take down the tone of the hands and leave the face as it is because the face seems quite alright but the exposure on the hand is pretty high as you can see we have created two holes for the hands in the exp uh, layer mask there and now let me just increase the exposure a little bit okay, that seems quite alright yeah and let me increase the gamma correction for having a little better tone in the skin uh, not that much okay so as you can see this is the effect that we have created with this layer seems good but what else we can do is I think yeah as you can see the effects are just applied on the hands and not the rest of our face we can do it but we're gonna leave the face as it is and just you can see the holes in the layer mask is just gonna stay like that 
and what else we can do is we can actually increase the tone in hand by grabbing a curve layer here and we're gonna inverse this layer too mm, yeah okay okay and let me just do the same thing again over here we're gonna make only holes for the hands and the curve layer too so that the curve applies only to the hands portion over here uh, that seems got it all right let me decrease it a little bit oh wait a second wait a second um maybe not that much uh, okay okay yeah that no, maybe not. You can see. Okay. You can see the effect that we have created here. With these two layers. That was the background side. Uh, yeah. If you want, you can actually... If you don't like the uh, curve layer, you can actually delete the layer by grabbing it and here we go. And the rest is just exposure layer. So that was our adjustment layer using layer mask. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.